What's going on, guys? Welcome to another episode of MZ Squared. We're back. Uh, <laughs> we didn't go anywhere. It's just been a while. Uh, this is episode five. 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 We're over the hump. All right. So on today's episode, uh, Marcella actually called me about it today. I don't know what what uh, le pegó. Well, it had been a while since we had. Hey. Hi. Since we had done one, so I was like, let me think of some topics that we could, you know, possibly talk about. So we decided to talk about uh, the time that we moved back in with the parents. So moving in with your parents, uh, have you guys ever had to do it or wanted to do it or whatnot? Um, for us, why did we do it? I'm trying, we to, <laughs> I'm trying to remember why we did it. We had just been living with a friend. A roommate. A we roommate. had a roommate. We had a roommate. And, you know, our lease was up. I think we decided to go to your parents so that we can start saving money for a down payment for a home. Yes. We figured, you know, we don't have to pay that much in rent and it'll help us save money. So. Wow, babe. Did you stop it? It's not even recording on, on the microphone. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> but it's up there. <laughs> It was such a good flow. You should be recording this. Que lo trajo? It is recording. <laughs> yeah, no, here, genius. Oh, my wow. God. Wow. All right. Uh, okay, so full recap, uh, MZ Squared, episode five. Uh, for those of you just tuning in on the podcast, <laughs> I forgot to press, play. press record. <laughs> or record. <laughs> so there's about two minutes that you missed. My, uh, <laughs> We're going to be talking about living uh, with the time that we moved in with our parents, kind of moving in with your parents. So for any of you out there that are looking to save money or are just down to the last wire, you don't have a choice. Uh, we got some, some, some tips for you. Um, so one thing that, uh, well, I just pulled up actually tips from online. This is thebalance.com. This is their uh, seven tips on how to make, how to move back in with your parents without going crazy have an exit strategy yes so the first one says is to have an exit strategy which I think we did uh, because we said we'll try it out for six months and did we tell them that no we told you like we, <laughs> no, we, <just laughs> we talked it. about it and said that if we can't come up with something after like after six months if we can't do it then we can just leave but uh, but your parents were kind of expecting us to be there for the year yeah, because we, the money that we were giving them for rent, they were using, you know, to pay some bills and stuff, you know? Well, which brings up number two. Uh, it says set up a formal agreement. Did uh, we set up a formal agreement? Yes. Uh, we we paid rent. We told them uh, they charged us, uh, I think, 500 bucks. 500 bucks a month, which uh, in California, Orange County, is nothing... We had our own room. We had access to a bathroom. Access uh, to the kitchen. Access, access to the kitchen. But we, we did have our own refrigerator and our own, like... My mom yeah. would make food every single day when we got home. There was food in the kitchen already. So, which worked out because Marcella had just given birth to Zaley. Um, so, we that moved, that kind of helped us. Back, to the, back to, to the beginning, I guess. We moved in in December. <laughs> Right, we moved in. Yeah, in our lease, our lease at our apartment was ending in like December fifteenth. We went to my my parents. In December, I had Zaylee in February. Well, the reason we went to my parents was because uh, my parents had a room available at the time, so we didn't think it would be an inconvenience to anybody. Uh, at your parents, there was no no room. I'm sure no if we went to room. your parents, <laughs> uh, we'd still be there. <laughs> <laughs> That was almost two years Good ago. Point, probably. <laughs> so let's. It worked out, right? Uh, okay, cool. So set up a formal agreement. We had that. We paid X amount a month. We told them we'd be there for a year. Maybe in hindsight, we could have given them a heads up saying that we'd be there. Uh, we'd check it out after six months, but yeah. you know, it, we're fine. Uh, number three, it says don't be a mooch. Um, did we do any chores around the house? I mean, I would sometimes help her wash the dishes. I mean, I would obviously do my own laundry, but I don't, I don't think so. No. Yeah. Really. So I don't think we were a mooch, but 
I have spoken to my mom. She says she doesn't like when people leave stuff around. I know. <laughs> I'm sure that we've left we've some left stuff, stuff around. around. So <laughs> for those of you thinking about it, just don't be a mooch. Pick up after yourselves because your mom probably won't tell you, but she she don't like it. Yep. Uh, okay, number four, uh, be prepared for parental judgments. Uh, yes. <laughs> This one, drinking for me, you know, so. Yeah, because when we had our own place, you know, if you, were, well, I was pregnant, but if you wanted to drink, just, you know, get home, have a beer or have a drink. But over here, it's like, they're always watching you. My mom's like, otra? <laughs> <laughs> Another one? It's all like, yeah, mom, why you, it comes in packs of six? <laughs> what am I supposed to do, just look at the other four? <laughs> and, yeah. So, parental judgments were tough, um, but... Honestly, it's not a big deal because it's my parents and we'd always just sneak it back into the room or so even sometimes when we bought food, I kind of felt, you know, it sucked because like, all right, I want to buy food. Like, I don't want to eat what's at home, but I want to enjoy it, but I don't want to buy for the whole house, you know, so it was, it was. We would buy food and sneak into the room and sit like on the corner of our bed and eat the food. And, and, or, or there were times like, you know what, let's buy some pizzas, you know what I mean? Yeah, so, we'll, yeah. so we'd yeah. all eat pizza or something, you know, but yeah. Um, number five is help out around the house. I think we just established that, that we, we did not. Did not. <laughs> uh, we, we cleaned up semi after ourselves. Yeah, I can't say that my mom did it. Well, she would bit. every time we would finish eating. Yes, we would pick up our plates. But she'd be like, "No, I the I the leave it there. I'll wash it later." Mm -hmm. <laughs> Which like, go take now care I of know your kids. means just wash it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, show your parents respect and courtesy. Yeah, I think it, it definitely changed it more from like my parents to like a roommate dynamic. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So when my mom would ask me something or my dad, I I felt more like not like I had to, but like. Yeah, I wanted to help him out. You know what I mean? Because like a room, I don't know. It's weird. I don't know. How do you feel? You show respect, respect and courtesy. Of course I did. They're your parents. I wouldn't disrespect them. Yeah, you're right. I you're hope right. I didn't. <laughs> and the number seven it says stay focused. Focused on why we were there. Yes. Well, it okay. We did. Yes, we did. We did save, but having to move into the apartment we're in now. You know, that kind of took our savings for all the deposits and having to pay this and pay that. and. So pretty much all, all in all, so we, we went. So another question is how to go. So first of all, why? We established the why. We wanted to save money to buy a house. How to go? Marcella, I'll let you go. <laughs> well, I mean, it, it, was, it was all right. It was, it was good when before I had... Did she just fart? <laughs> <laughs> Did you fart, mamas? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For those of you listening, she just nodded yes. <laughs> and like, is no shame, no nothing. Oh my goodness. Um, so yeah, when we first moved in, I was still pregnant with Zaylee, so it was all right. It was just the three of us in the room. But like after I had her, I it was kind of hard because you know having now. a newborn a newborn baby, it was four of us in one room, and then your brothers would stay up super late um playing video games not just not just during the weekend sometimes during the week too and screaming and yelling at the tv because they were playing video games and i have a newborn baby and then you know i'd, I'd have to pump and then sometimes your dad would want to come into the room and it's like oh hold on she's like not decent and then it's just and having to go into the shower i'd always have to like be super careful and like make sure I was covered up because you know obviously I'm not gonna be walking around in my underwear. So I mean that that was kind of tough, but. So as far as privacy goes. Privacy, but yeah, that was, I think that was my biggest thing. So privacy. Privacy. Yeah, you know it kind of affects the the Marcella and Martin time. <laughs> yeah, that was hard too. Yeah. <laughs> Four people in one room. Yeah, she. <laughs> She had the baby while there, so six weeks, you know how that goes. <laughs> R.I.P. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so uh, I guess another question, so would we do it again? All in all, now in high, it's been two years later, uh, we're here now, this is we, wherever, where we're at, we already renewed our lease, so it's already been over a year. Yeah. I think two years, I think what here. I said. Um, but would you do it again? If it was at my parents' house, yeah, probably. 
I would. It wasn't my parents' yeah, house. Yeah, because our parents. Uh, you, oh, were, no. you were comfortable because it was your parents. You grew up in that house, so you you. It was like you were just back there, you know. Back home. I had three more people with you. Yeah. All but in uh, all. if I was not to be mean or anything, but if it was just your parents by themselves, like nobody else lived there, like your brothers had already, you know, gotten married, moved out, whatever. In that case, probably I, I would do it again. Cool. Well, but, if you're looking to do it, <laughs> it did help save money. You know what I mean? Um, when we moved out, all the money left right there. So yeah. It didn't really. <laughs> it was a good six months, it I guess. For you the know? Six months. It, but... My mom helped with Zaley at the beginning, so it, it had its perks. All in all, yeah, it was cool. Would I do it again at your parents? I guess I kind of have to. You know what I mean? You tried it at my parents, so I guess uh, Zamora's tamales. Let's go. <laughs> Keep me from going. <laughs> but anyways, uh, all yeah. right. Uh, so. That is our insight on um, moving back in with your parents. So uh, we'll see you guys next week with a different topic. Peace. Cool. <gasps> <gasps> what happened? Okay, bye.